Hello, welcome to Daily News from Ajaya TV. Daily scientific meetings of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in holy city of Qom, Iran. The residence of His Eminence Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hosseini Shirazi hosted another enlightening scholarly session in the holy city of Qom, attended by numerous scholars, religious figures and students of Islamic seminaries. This meeting delved into various topics pertaining to Islamic ethics, Islamic jurisprudence, Islamic history, etc. This team viewers of Ajaya TV can watch these sessions live and directly on this TV network, a collection of other TV channels and also on the Al Shirazi app and TV boxes, simultaneously with these sessions at 11 a.m. Qom local time. Iraqi pilgrimage caravan visits House of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in Holy Qom, Iran. On Tuesday, 5th of Jumadi Uthani, 1445 AH, December 19, 2023, the residents of the esteemed Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hosseini Shirazi in the holy city of Qom hosted a pilgrimage caravan from Iraq. On this day, members of the pilgrimage caravan Ahbab al Hussein from the city of Tubiriz in Iraq visited the residence of the religious authority and participated in an academic session with the scholars and the students of the Qom Seminary. Subsequently, they had a meeting with Sayyid Hussein Shirazi the esteemed son of the noble religious authority. Markeb of Karbala residents served food to pilgrims of Lady Masuma peace be upon her in Holy Qom, Iran. The procession of the residents of Karbala affiliated with the religious authority extended its hospitality to the believers in the holy city of Qom for three days while stationed in the city. This annual initiative by the procession takes place during the days of the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra peace be upon her. Members of the procession engage in daily hospitality by distributing various food and beverages, catering to hundreds of Fatimi mourners. It is noteworthy that the activities of this procession align with the recommendations of the esteemed Grand Ayatollah Shirazi, emphasizing the importance of honoring Fatimi rituals. Representative of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi visits exhibition of Life of Lady Fatima peace be upon her in India. During the Fatimiya days, a large exhibition highlighting the life of Lady Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her, has been organized in the city of Lucknow, Uttar Pradesh, India. Within this contest, Sheikh Mustafa Adib Hindi, a representative of the esteemed Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in India, visited this exhibition. This exhibition, titled Fatimi Exhibition, was hosted at the Muhammad Ali Shah Husseiniya in the city of Lucknow. This exhibition not only delves into the aspects of the life of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, but also provides insights into the early Islamic events. Sheikh Mustafa Adipendi expressed appreciation for the efforts of those involved during this visit to this exhibition. PR Office of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi welcomes public visitors in Holy Kabbala, Iraq. Sayyid Arif Nasullah, the public relations manager of the esteemed Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Husseini Shirazi in Kabbala, hosted the president of the Iraqi Wrestling Federation and his accompanying delegation. During this meeting, Said Arif Nasullah emphasized the importance of sports for the Iraqi youth and the necessity of government support for sports activities through backing federations and teams. He also played host to some of the citizens of the holy city of Kabbalah. In this gathering, Said Arif Nasullah urged the Iraqi government to respect the voters' choice in the upcoming elections and strive for a fair and healthy electoral process. Member of Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's office in Holy Qom visits cultural centers in Baghdad, Iraq. In recent days, the Baghdad Residence Association and the Al Sadiqa Fatima Center hosted Sheikh Mehdi Maash, a member of the Office of the Religious Authority in the Holy City of Qom, along with Nasir al Shamani, the director of the Al Shire Media Collection. These meetings focus on the activities of the two centers, as well as the significance of involving youth in religious gatherings and events. Ahlul Bayt Husseiniya mourns passing of Ayatollah Sayyid Muhammad Reza Shirazi in Bahrain. A grand ceremony commemorating the 16th anniversary of the demise of the late Ayatollah Sayyid Muhammad Reza Husseini Shirazi took place at the Ahlul Bayt Mosque in Bahrain. This event witnessed the presence of a large gathering of believers and noble figures from religious, cultural and social spheres. Sheikh Abdulaziz Muhtadi, the representative of the esteemed Grand Ayatollah Shirazi, delivered a speech during this ceremony reflecting on the life and contributions of the revered scholar. Shia believers hold Fatimi morning ceremonies in Sweden. A morning ceremony commemorating the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her, was held at the Husseini of Mutawassalin, dedicated to Hazrat Fatima Zahra and Hazrat Khadija Kobra, peace be upon them, in the city of Wimmerby, Sweden. The Fatimiya event, attended by a multitude of admirers of the Ahlul Bayt, delved into the examination of the role of Hazrat Zahra, peace be upon her, in the events following the martyrdom of the Holy Prophet of Islam. 
Director of Grand Ayatollah Shiraz's office in Basra attends opening of the Al Muntadar Center. Sheikh Nazar Al Hassan, the director of the office of the esteemed Grand Ayatollah Shirazi, participated in the inauguration ceremony of Imam Al Mahdi Husseiniya in the city of Basra. The opening ceremony of this Husseiniya took place on the 4th of Jamadi Uthani of this year, with the presence of various religious and cultural figures, believers, and the servants of the Husseini cause. Fatimiyah Association holds Fatimi memorials in Holy Kom, Iran. The Fatimiyah Association, one of the prominent centers affiliated with the religious authority in the holy city of Qom, is holding morning ceremonies in commemoration of the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her. The annual rituals of this association commence from the first narration of the martyrdom of Hazrat Zahra, the narration of the 40th day after the martyrdom of the Holy Prophet, and continue until the birth anniversary of this noble lady. Members of this association and believers gather each night at the home of a faithful individual to observe Fatimi morning rituals. Special Programs of Office of Grand Ayatollah Shirazi in Mazar Sharif, Afghanistan On Friday, 1st of Jamadi Uthani, 1445 AH, the Office of Grand Ayatollah Sayyid Sara Hosseini Shirazi continued its charitable activities by sacrificing several sheep in the city of Mazar Sharif, Afghanistan. This initiative provided meat to dozens of orphaned and needy families in the city of Mazar Sharif. This undertaking carried out in collaboration with the Ali Asin Mosque in Hosseinia, affiliated with the religious authority in Sydney, Australia. During these days, the Office of the Esteemed Religious Authority in Mazar Sharif, Afghanistan, also organized morning ceremonies to mark the anniversary of the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her. The morning event held on Sunday, 3rd of Jamadi Uthani, 1445 AH, saw the participation of mourners and believers from this city, as well as religious, cultural, and social figures. Memorial Services of Late Muhammad Bagr Fali in Damascus, Syria The funeral ceremony of the Lukun preacher, the late Said Muhammad Bagr Fali, was held in the centers affiliated with the religious authority in Damascus, Syria. These ceremonies organized at the office of the Grand Ayatollah Shirazi, through the participation of dozens of religious, cultural, and social figures, as well as diverse gathering of faithful men and women. Attendees gather to seek forgiveness from the Almighty for the blessed soul of the departed and pray for his eternal joy. Shia believers hold Fatimi morning ceremonies in Madagascar. In Mahajanga Madagascar, centers affiliated with the religious authority commemorated the anniversary of the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her, through morning ceremonies. These ceremonies, attended by scores of believers and followers of the Ahlul Bayt, aim to honor the days of the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra. These events included reflections on the martyrdom of this revered figure and drew participation from dozens of faithful attendees. Notable among the organizing centers were the Ahlul Bayt Center and the Umul Bani Center, peace be upon them. Imam Shirazi Foundation holds conference in Holy Kabbalah, Iraq. Imam Shirazi Foundation in Kabbalah explored the topic of the role of digital transformation in youth engagement during the academic session. This gathering, attended by various authors, intellectuals, academics, delved into the examination of the content and ideas presented in the research paper by Mr. Muhammad Alal Safi. This paper unequivocally states that the digital sector holds immense profit potentials for individuals, companies, and entire economies. Digital transformation facilitates access to information and services at both personal and business levels, enhancing economic growth and creates numerous job opportunities. In today's interconnected world, the digital realm guides innovation and competition globally, playing a crucial role in shaping societies. Amidst technological advancements, Iraq should not lag behind. Fatima Zahra Center donates food to needy in Beirut, Lebanon. As part of the commemoration of the martyrdom anniversary of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her, the hospitality center associated with the religious authority in Beirut, Lebanon, generously donated food supplies to the Shia community in this city. This benevolent gesture took place on Sunday, the 3rd of Jamadi Athani of this year, in honor of the anniversary of the martyrdom of the Lady of the Two Worlds, Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her. Tariq An nur Institute holds Fatimi morning ceremonies in Baghdad, Iraq. Tariq An nur Foundation in Baghdad, affiliated with Baraka Association, linked to the religious authority, held a commemorative ceremony for the martyrdom of Hazrat Fatima Zahra, peace be upon her. This event, starting on Saturday, 2nd of Jamadi Athani, 1445, began with the recitation verses from the Noble Quran. It continued with the reading of the Noble Hadith of Kisa and excerpts from the sermon of Hazrat Zahra, peace be upon her, accompanied by a lecture. The symbolic funeral procession of the pure body of Hazrat Fatima Zahra was also conducted during this ceremony, attended by a gathering of the women.